Hi, I'm Stephen from the Sign Up Genius team. In today's feature tip, we're going to talk about custom questions. Custom questions are fields that you can add to your sign up, and they're fields for participants to complete as a part of the sign up process. So you could attach it as a question, or you could formulate it just as a field, and it could be things like selecting t shirt sizes, or it could be you could ask the different types of meals that people want to select from as a part of an event. So there's just really a variety of ways that you can attach these fields to the sign up for people to complete. Let's take a look. In the actual sign up builder under the settings tab, you'll see a lot of features and here we see the ability to add or manage custom questions. Now I've already created some custom questions for this particular sign up, but let's take a look at the tool and just see how this works and how we can set up a custom question. So within the tool you create the option to create a new question and you can enter and formulate your question here, whatever you wanted to ask or, or the statement you wanted to make, like select t-shirt sizes or things like that. And then there are different formats for the question, which is really helpful. So you could have a text box where people can type in the information. Uh, you could have number boxes where people can, uh, can enter in one, two, three, four. You could also have check boxes where people select from multiple different types of, uh, of selections. Um, the option buttons are those little radio buttons where people select one or, the, or, or mo one or the other. And uh, it could be like a yes or no type question, or you could have multiple different types of option buttons for people to select from. And then finally, you also have a drop down list where you have predefined fields, and then people are selecting from that drop down list. And you would enter that here as far as all the different values that you wanted to include in any of these, whether they're radio buttons or drop down lists. And then you can select whether you want this question to be required or if you want it to be optional. And then any help comments if you feel like you need to explain. A little bit of extra details about why or what people are answering to help them answer this question best. And uh, let's take a look at how this is actually set up on a live sign up. And so we'll go into to this particular sign up as if we were signing up for a conference. And you can see on here that just as a participant would come in and sign up for a particular slot, these predefined questions now are already here on this existing sign up where they would enter their uh, their contact name and number. You can see here is a drop down list where they're actually going to select. Um, from different types of company names. And then uh, the third question was radio buttons where they would select one or the other. So in this case, uh, a meal choice, and we could select one of those as well before proceeding on to, to getting signed up. So that it's a great way for you to be able to, to attach these fields to your sign up in order to acquire more information from participants as a part of the sign up process. So get it started today using custom questions as a part of your sign up creation process. Thank <laughs> you.